The day our hometown burned, that was the day we enlisted. At last, we had something to believe in, something worth fighting for. None of us yet knew. We couldn't foresee what this war would cost us. It was a battlefield, but it was where we grew up. Wallace, voilà, c'est pas euh, les mecs qui sont censés commander les tanks, les Wallace là, je me rappelle un peu du, du premier Valkyria. C'est beau, c'est beau la guerre. Magnifique. Wind out of the northeast, clear skies, and out of... Oh. Uh. Huh? Nap time's over. Come on, Raz. I wasn't napping, just resting my eyes. You gotta relax, man. You are way too freaking tense. Your hands are shaking. <laughs> so sack up, Commander. It's about time we get ready to roll out. Let's show those imps what's coming to them. Yeah. <clears throat> A shift in the wind. There. Huh? You getting those wind whispers again? Imperials incoming! All right, boys, it's go time! Wow. Squad E! <laughs> ça, ça tue. Do you read me, Squad E? This is Commander Claude Wallace. Squad E! The Imperial forces are on the move, heading for your position! Ready to engage. <coughs> Do not let them break through to the front line. We're counting on you. Roger that. Over. Good luck, Squad E. They won't advance until they're done shelling the area. We should have time to prepare. Kai, take a group to that southern hill and slow down their left flank. Raz, take two soldiers east and make some noise for me. You got that? Gotcha. Keep up or get left behind. At your command. Hoffin, roll out. Wow. Squaddy, ready to engage. All right. Just remember your training. C'est comme un Metal Gear, mais sur chenille. We can do this. Ah, ça tue. C'est les Vampteurs, ça va. Eliminate all Imperial Hostiles. Let's stop their advance. Squad E, move out. Ok. Just say the word, boss. I'm locked, loaded, and in freaking visible. Locked and loaded. Yeah. Okay. First, we'll see how they respond to some infantry. Squad E, move out. Phase du joueur. Alors, je me rappelle vaguement comment on joue. Okay. Looks like everyone's in position. Finally, it's time. I'm their commander. It's up to me to get everyone out alive. Concentrate. Remember your training. We can do this. Yeah. Peut le faire. Le mode commandement. Le vieux commandement carte de zone apparaît dans la position de votre unité. Le mode commandement. Alors je me rappelle, il faut d'abord placer ses troupes sur le terrain ou les choisir, et puis après on peut les avancer après, en combat. Donc là, il y a la, il y a la jauge d'action. Euh, si un des personnages principaux meurt, on perd une, un PC aussi, je crois, un truc comme ça. Termine la phase, commander. Ok, évacuation de commandement, liste d'unités, pour l'instant on a que Raz, on a trois éclaireurs en face, cool Ok, menu, menu, objectif, tuer les ennemis, ok. Euh, défaite, faut que personne meure et il faut le faire en moins de 20 tours, ça va. Euh, ça va bien, ça va bien, je viens juste de commencer. <coughs> sauvegarde, sauvegarde. Yes. Ok. Euh, 
tutoriel option. Non, c'est bon. Ok, let's go. I got this. <coughs> Alors, le jouage de P1 en bas, l'écran diminue, il peut appeler lorsqu'une unité se déplace. Alors, ça, je me rappelle, une fois que le soldat est dépensé ses payes, il ne peut plus se déplacer. Mais après, je peux faire l'action, c'est ça Je crois que je peux tirer. Si je me rappelle bien. Waouh, c'est trop beau, c'est trop classe. On peut changer, on a quoi Ok, on a une grenade, on a un ragnet, je sais pas ce que c'est. Et on a le Robinson. Let's go RB, ok. Utilise A pour attaquer, c'est une survie, le risque de riposter, c'est une... Tu peux pas te mettre derrière le... Voilà. S'accroupir. Yeah, je m'en rappelle, mode visé, ok. Ah oui c'est comme avant, Alors, ça c'est 7 coups au corps et il meurt Et là 2 coups à la tête il meurt Mais c'est plus, c'est moins précis du coup Ah, headshot Ah je teste à la manette pour le moment enfin, On n'a pas vraiment besoin de la précision de la souris pour ce jeu donc euh... Enfin, peut-être après, après quand ce sera plus difficile Mais pour le moment ça va Bah, sinon on peut modifier toutes les touches de la manette et du clavier, c'est vraiment cool. Pretty good. Pretty good. Stand firm, or they'll drive us all back. Ok, go. Ah, on peut rester accroupi, j'avais oublié ça, c'est tout le temps. Requesting intel on the enemy strength. Ah. Aïe, 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 aïe. Je l'avais déjà fait, je l'avais déjà fait. Euh, euh, euh. Tu veux te mettre Ah ouais je peux plus Je peux plus attaquer c'est ça Ok on peut se mettre là comme ça okay. Non Pire. Carte Comment Ok On peut attaquer qu'une fois Non Are you really getting tripped up over some common foot soldiers? Why don't you ever stop and think? Oh, shut up! Just hurry and take them out, will ya? Thought you'd never ask. This won't take long. On est, on est en guerre, mais faisons les malins. Lançons-nous des vannes les uns les autres. Ouais, non, c'est qu'une action qu'on peut faire, si je me rappelle bien. Now advancing. J'ai essayé de re-attaquer, mais en fait, non. Oh, regardez-moi ces fesses. Les snipers. Avec un sniper, ils ont des tirs d'ennemis à distance. Regardez-moi ces fesses, quoi. Oh, la vache. Est-ce qu'on peut faire plus sexy que ça, ou pas Alors, t'as un regnet et t'as le sniper. Ok. Est-ce que les snipers peuvent se mettre à... Ils ont pas une habilité spéciale, genre ils peuvent se mettre par terre. Ah, Mets-toi au milieu des fleurs. C'est quoi cet, euh, ce symbole sur lui C'est qu'il a, il a monté de niveau Qu'est-ce qui se passe Il lui commande. Here comes the pain. Here comes the pain. Okay, go. Everyone, do your best. Do your best. Ils sont où les mecs? Attends, attends. Ils sont où les mecs? Carte. Ok, là, je les vois pas. Merde. Alors. Consomme un point de commandement. Limite le nombre de fois où vous contrôlez les ennemis par phase. Lorsqu'il n'y a plus de PC, la phase de joueur se termine, la phase d'ennemis commence. Yes. 
Ah oui, c'est vrai qu'il faut les voir, les ennemis, je crois. Et vu qu'elle les voit, on les voit se déplacer. Mais sinon, on n'entend que des bruits. Ah ouais, reste exposé. Ah, c'est bon, ça. Ouais, c'est pas mal, ça. Pretty good. Ça peut être plusieurs fois la suite sur la même unité. Ceci est utile pour percer l'ennemi, franchir le terrain aussi, il doit achever des ennemis coriaces. <rire> Cependant, ils sont épuisés au début. Chaque action constituée avec moins de PA que pour la dernière. Ah oui, ça je me rappelle. Bon. Si on utilise la même personne, elle va avoir la, la barre d'action moins longue à chaque fois. Oh mon dieu, on a plein de gens. Ils ont des points faibles. Ah, ça, ça, je l'ai expliqué déjà. Si on testait la sniper, ça fait loin, mais déjà envie. Oui. Oh yes, oh yes. Oh, headshot. Elle est bonne et bonne. Metal Gear. Busting out the tanks, huh? This one's all yours, Claude. It's our turn now. Fire up the engine, Miles. Yes, sir. Okay, the Hoffman's moving out. Destroy the enemy tank. Choo-hoo! Oui, elle est les deux. Eh. On va l'appeler bébé. Bonne et bonne. La plus grande endurance du char surpasse celle des unités terrestres. Pourquoi on n'a pas que des chars Je me suis toujours demandé ça en fait. Euh, c'est vrai des modes de cou couverture. Ah oui, c'est vrai qu'ils peuvent se cacher derrière le char. Tirer et rouler sur les objets marqués d'un X rouge sur la carte. Passager 3 bloque les chars d'utiliser l'infanterie pour continuer. Ah Je me rappelle pas de ça. Donc là, genre, il peut pas passer. Non. Si, c'est le dessin d'un char. Ça aussi, c'est le dessin d'un char. Là aussi. Je me rappelais pas qu'il pouvait pas. qu'il y avait ça sur la carte dans le premier. Peut-être qu'il aura loupé. Ok, moving out. Oh mon dieu. Oh mon dieu. Let's go. Alors il faut cacher le point faible. On va se mettre comme ça. Alors. Déjà on a trois types d'attaques. L'objet anti-blindage, le mortier explosif et une mitrailleuse. Anti-blindage. Non, blindage contre les autres véhicules, mortier frappe large jaune idéal pour les contrer l'infanterie. Euh, trajectoire du mortier est un arc, ouais ça je me rappelle. Ça marche. Munition anti-blindage. Euh, on va tester ça, mais ça m'étonnerait que ça passe. C'est vrai qu'à la manette, c'est quand même. Euh... Right there. Oh Roi de la guerre. <rire> Anyone else want to try? Squad E don't take shit from nobody. 
Claude knows what I'm. Oh, you okay? The flowers. Oh. Uh. J'ai roulé sur des fleurs, merde. Yeah, they didn't stand a chance. Come on, man. You're supposed to be commander of the Ranger Corps. A commander still has a heart, same as a foot soldier. No. Oh. Rank doesn't make this any less painful to see. Oh, but crying over flowers? Even little girls have bigger balls these days. Maybe. But what matters is that their hearts... All right, I get it. Power of the heart, blah, blah, blah. Look, just go turn in your report already, will ya? Can't go get sloshed if we're stuck here on standby. Good point. I'll head to the command center. <laughs> Yeah, you do that. Ça il me fait marrer dans le jeu. Alors on vient de massacrer des gens et de les tuer, hein. Les tuer, genre ils rentreront jamais chez leur famille, hein. Ils sont morts. Mais on vient d'écraser des fleurs, merde. C'est triste. Commandant compétent. Merci. Rang quoi Qu'est-ce que c'est que cette lettre Je vois de l'or partout, donc c'est bien. Opération Northern Cross. Yes. Youhou, whoop. Prologue, prologue. Ah, ah oui, ça c'est l'auto. Okay. C'est cinématique du début, ça c'est le combat, et maintenant on en est là. C'est les méchants, c'est pas grave, c'est vrai. First Lieutenant Claude Wallace reporting in. Good work out there. Glad you're still in one piece. J'ai tiré un seul, euh, un seul obus, le truc a explosé. Ça va. C'était pas dur. Ah, toi aussi, t'es bon. Putain, I'm sure you know. Standard procedure is to report immediately after a mission. Oh, Minerva, you're reporting too. Minerva. That's lieutenant to you, Claude. Don't get smart with me just because we share rank. I've got seniority. <coughs> Sorry, Lieutenant Minerva Victor. Hmm. Hmm. Well, let's get started. Hmm. Minerva, give us a situation report. Yes, sir. Three months have passed since we went to war. I won't sugarcoat it. They're steamrolling us. By this point, a third of our territory is under imperial control. This is a... If it's that bad already, we won't even be able to sustain a war effort. You're right. And the Empire's only gaining momentum. If this draws out much longer... The Federation's finished. If we fall, that's it for Europa. Nobody else could stand against them. The Empire would take total control. It'd be a fascist continent ruled with an iron fist. We can't let that happen. Europa's future depends on us. Which brings us to now. The top brass finally got off their seats and sent us a plan. A counterattack that can turn the war around in one fell swoop, ready to be put into action. What are the orders? We put all our force into one strike. Break through their defenses and hit them where they'll hurt most. Soldiers, supplies. We'll use all reserves we have to make a final push and capture one crucial enemy base. And we lucky few of the 32nd Armored Ranger Battalion have been handpicked as the vanguard. Couldn't ask for a better mission, sir. Which enemy base are we targeting? Think bigger. We take this base, and we take their will to fight. But how could any one target mean that much to... Wait, you don't mean... You always were a clever boy, Claude. I think you've got it. Our target is the Imperial capital of Schwarzgrad. Let's fight back! Operation Northern Cross. 
The year was 1935 EC. Two great powers vied to control the continent of Europa. In the east, the sun rose over the autocratic East European Imperial Alliance, a dictatorship known as the Empire. In the west, a network of loosely allied democracies banded together to form the Atlantic Federation. Both powers depended on a precious mineral, Ragnite, for their prosperity, its growing scarcity leading inevitably to war. With its overwhelming military might, the Empire captured one nation after another. While the Federation struggled to maintain unity, every battle driving them further back against the wall. Three months have passed. With seven-tenths of Europa falling to the Imperial War Machine, the Federation places all its hope in a desperate counterattack. Operation Northern Cross. Six million soldiers fought in this campaign. It claimed more lives than any other in the Second European War. Federation historians call it the Eastern Theater, but the Empire knows it as the War for the Motherland. Forward, soldiers! This is the battle you've been training for! Operation Northern Cross begins now! We'll wipe those Imperials clear off the face of Europa! Our time has come! Forward, to victory! Countless soldiers fought and died on those fields, struggling to make their ideals a reality. Ordinary people thrust into extraordinary circumstances, fighting in the hopes that they would see a brighter future. What follows here is a record of those brave warriors, a record of that battle against the dark. Based on the diary of one Claude Wallace, the commander of the Federation's Gallian Squad E, Valkyria Chronicles 4 Putain, c'est beau la guerre C'est beau la guerre. Salut les autres, bienvenue. Magnifique. Chapter 1, The Battle of Fort Crest. Good news, Claude. Ah. HQ has awarded you with a medal. Ah oh. C'est toi qui vas me la donner, la médaille Balle bridée. Et sauvegarde. Alors, fais voir. Où est-ce qu'on... Où est-ce que... On n'a pas encore le quartier pour s'équiper et tout ça, c'est ça March the 10th. At long last, we have finally entered Imperial territory. The ferocity of the Federation counterattack caught the Empire off guard. Battle by battle, town by town, we're pushing back the front, with no signs of slowing down. The road to Schwarzgrad is a long one, running at least 1500 kilometers from friendly territory into the heart of the Empire. But at the end of it lies our target, the capital city. Super loin. We have a long trek ahead of us, but for now, morale is high. Everyone here believes in this operation. Everyone is praying it'll succeed. <laughs> I guess the Empire is not so tough after all, huh, Commander? Give them one good stomp and, and all of a sudden they're running off home. Huh? So are you gonna take a picture of everything we pass? Here, let me have a look at it. <sighs> Hey, Raz, come on! <laughs> Stop it, really! You're wasting my film! Wasting? No chance. What you got here is a picture of a future hero. <gasps> you take one too, eh, Kai? Yeah, maybe. Sans vêtements. S'il vous plaît. There you go. That's a keeper. Wow. Uh, damn it, Miles! The hell was that for? Freaking hurt, Quiet. man! I told him to stop the tank. Huh? Everything okay? Restez concentré, peut-être. <laughs> Sans marrant.
encore une bataille. They brought out the big guns. A blast that big could wipe out a whole squad. Easy. Let's keep moving. Ah, ils ont peut-être un, vraiment un métal Our rendezvous point with squad F should be nearby. <coughs> Flash. Thunder. That's the password. Next time, give us the response before you scare us shitless. Apologies. I didn't mean to frighten you. Follow me. Lieutenant Victor is waiting. On est dans un monde où où tout ce qui est avion, hélicoptère, en fait, tout ce qui vole n'existe pas apparemment. Et euh, ça pourrait tellement mettre un terme à la guerre. <rire> T'envoies juste quelques avions, tu bombardes et hop, c'est fini. Who? Oh, you mean Minerva. And you are Corporal Crystal Ward from Squad F. Enfin, je crois. Indeed. I have the honor of answering to Minerva Victor, the strongest and smartest officer in the army. <rire> Uh... <laughs> <coughs> I assume you saw that explosion. Oh, we saw it all right. They must be packing serious heat. A 21 centimeter howitzer. Currently, our worst nightmare. Un mortier. It must have a range of at least 10 kilometers. We can't advance with that thing around. Just so. Our mission is to capture that camp. Commander! Good work leading Squad E so far, Claude. Your slow pace, however, does leave something to be desired. We saw cannon fire, so we've been proceeding with caution. Keep your excuses. As I said before, the success of Operation Northern Cross hinges on our swift advance. Time is of the essence. I know. You try hustling with a huge cannon up your ass. Oh, wait. You already tried and failed. <laughs> Down, boy. Claude, have you not housebroken your squad? The hell did you say? I'd appreciate it if you didn't insult my soldiers. They're people, not pets. Then I expect them to act like it. I'm not the one wagging my tongue. On pourrait se reconcentrer sur la mission. On a un canon qui nous vise. Soldiers who step out of line are often the first to die. Remember that, Sergeant Raz. Yeah, yeah. Hope you make it out alive too, Lieutenant. <rire> non, um, euh... Commander. Vous pouvez vous embrasser déjà. Uh, there's a good view from the clearing. Maybe we could brief them there. Claude, come with me. J'aime bien les petites euh, chamailleries. C'est marrant. Allow me to explain your next mission. As you know, Ooh. Fort Crest has a 21 cm howitzer that's blocking our advance. It might just look like an old castle turned into a makeshift fort. But they've stationed quite a few troops to defend the cannon. Il est où ton canon? If we get too close, those turrets on the walls will mow us down. So when does our own cannon get here? That howitzer already destroyed it. We were outranged. Blown up already? How long will the replacement take? The bridge was destroyed too, so the artillery tractor can't proceed. It will take at least seven days. Though we do have plenty of infantry en route. Doesn't matter how many foot soldiers we get. Without a cannon, we're just waiting around. Not necessarily. Huh? Oh, il a le plan. Time is of the essence. We don't have a week to wait. You're as sharp as ever. Like he says, we can't afford to wait. We'll have to capture the fort without artillery. That's too reckless. Those turrets would fill us with more holes than golly and cheese. <laughs> It's a dangerous mission, I know. But those are your orders. This isn't your local militia. This is what you signed up for when you joined the Edinburgh Army. You're right. We enlisted to crush the Empire, not to commit suicide. Then allow me to clue you in on something. Crystal, tell them the news. Yes, ma'am. 
This morning, the Empire invaded Galia. They've... invaded? I knew it was only a matter of time. What about our hometown? Is Hoffman okay? All we know is that the battle broke out near the border, at Citadel Girlandio. The Imperial Army, however, is being led by Prince Maximilian himself. Galia's prospects look grim. Oh, damn it! Is there nothing we can do? If Operation Northern Cross goes as planned, the Empire won't have the luxury of staying on the offensive. Our only option is to complete the mission as soon as possible. Guess we've got no choice then. If our home's in the Empire's sights, then we've got to protect it! Yeah, let's do it for Galia. Ouais, allons au suicide. 